Hey Shroomers, welcome back. Are you ready to embark on an incredible journey today? To unravel the secret behind growing the elusive and delectable golden chanterelle mushrooms at home. Often considered the crown jewel of the culinary world, these gourmet fungi are prized for their exquisite flavor, tender texture, and stunning appearance. Boasting a unique apricot-like aroma, golden chanterelles have become the ultimate forager's treasure. In today's video, we'll take a deep dive into the captivating world of golden chanterelle mushrooms and provide you with a guide on how to maximize your chances of growing them successfully at home. For many years, growers believed cultivating chanterelles was impossible, as they thought these fungi were too dependent on their natural habitat and the specific conditions in the wild. Despite advances in our knowledge of chanterelle mushrooms, they remain challenging to grow due to their particular requirements regarding temperature, humidity, and substrate. However, we're here today to challenge those beliefs and demonstrate that you can still have a shot at growing these gourmet delicacies at home with the proper knowledge and techniques. So stick around as we embark on this exciting journey together. By the end of the video, you'll be well equipped to give yourself the best chance to cultivate your very own golden chanterelles, transforming your kitchen into a mushroom lover's paradise. Golden chanterelles have a special mystique that surrounds them, thanks to their vibrant color and enchanting aroma. They're notoriously challenging to forge in the wild, often hidden beneath tree canopies and forming symbiotic relationships with tree roots. For this reason, forgers consider them as a rare and precious prize. Recent breakthroughs in mycology have unlocked some of the secrets of cultivating golden chanterelles, enabling people worldwide to grow these fungi in their gardens and homes successfully. Today, we'll share these secrets with you so you can also experience the joy and satisfaction of growing your very own golden chanterelle mushrooms. So hold on to your hat folks as we dive headfirst into the world of chanterelle cultivation and unveil the techniques that have revolutionized the mushroom growing community. Getting started, materials and supplies. To kick things off, let's go through the essential materials and supplies you'll need for a successful cultivation journey. First, you'll need high quality chanterelle spawn, which is the foundation for your mushroom growing adventure. When planting crops, you must get seeds or seedlings for the plant. In the case of mushroom, the seeds are called spores and the seedlings are called spawns. To grow chanterelle mushrooms, you need to either buy a prepared grow kit or you can get the spores from you need from mature chanterelles. If you are new to growing mushrooms, it will be easier to buy a kit. Next, you'll need a suitable substrate to mimic their natural habitat ensuring your chanterelles have the best environment to thrive. A substrate mixture could include a combination of hardwood sawdust, leaf litter, and compost. You may also add some mycorrhizal inoculant, which contains beneficial fungi that form symbiotic relationships with tree roots to enhance the chances of successful chanterelle growth. Then, you'll require a container or raised bed to house your mushrooms providing them with ample space and protection. Growers often mention the use of a tray with drainage holes. Finally, you'll need basic but essential environmental control equipment like grow lights, humidifiers, or spray bottles, and one-way fans to maintain optimal temperature, humidity, and airflow. Growing chanterelle mushrooms. Step one, preparing the substrate. Begin by mixing your substrate ingredients to create the perfect environment for your chanterelles. Once mixed, you'll need to sterilize the substrate to eliminate any contaminants that could harm your mushrooms. There are various sterilization methods, but one popular option is to steam the substrate for 90 minutes at 15 PSI with a pressure cooker. Step 2. Inoculating the substrate with spawn. After cooling your substrate, it's time to introduce the chanterelle spawn. Be sure to follow proper techniques, 
such as spreading the spawn evenly throughout the substrate and maintaining a sterile environment to prevent contamination. Remember, cleanliness is critical during the step. Step 3. Creating Ideal Growing Conditions Golden chanterelles thrive in specific conditions, so it's crucial to maintain the correct temperature, humidity, light, and ventilation levels. Aim for a temperature of around 65 to 75 degrees Fahrenheit, or 18 to 24 degrees Celsius. Humidity levels between 80 to 90 percent, and provide indirect or diffuse light at least 12 hours per day. Also make sure there's adequate airflow, but please do avoid direct drafts. Step 4. Monitoring and maintaining the growing environment. Regularly check on your mushrooms and adjust to conditions as needed. This includes misting the substrate to keep humidity levels and adjusting your environmental control equipment as required. Step 5. Identifying and troubleshooting common problems. During cultivation process, you may encounter issues like mold or pest. Stay vigilant and address these problems promptly to ensure the health and success of your golden chanterelles. Harvesting and storage. Congratulations, you have made it to the most rewarding part of your golden chanterelles cultivation journey. In this segment, we'll share tips on how and when to harvest, preserve, and store your chanterelles. First, let's talk about when to harvest. Timing is crucial to ensure the best flavor and texture. You'll know your golden chanterelles are ready when their caps have a convex shape and the edges start to curl upwards. The vibrant golden color and enticing aroma are also telltale signs that it is time to pick your mushrooms. Now, on to proper harvesting techniques. To harvest your chanterelles, gently twist and pull the mushroom from the substrate or use a very sharp knife to cut the stem at the base. Be careful not to disturb the surrounding mycelium as this ensures future growth. Preserving and storing your harvest is essential to maintaining its quality. Fresh chanterelles can be stored in a paper bag in the refrigerator for up to a week. For a longer storage time, consider dehydrating, freeze drying, or pickling your mushrooms to enjoy their exquisite flavor all year round. As a new grower, you may find the details complex, but plenty of growers see success, even if it takes multiple tries. It's important to go into the process knowing that the results are a bit like baking bread, partially out of your control. Keep going even if it doesn't work the first time. We hope this journey has inspired and motivated you to try Golden Chanterelle cultivation. With patience, attention to detail, and a little experimentation, you too can become a successful mushroom grower and enjoy the satisfaction of savoring your homegrown chanterelles. If you've found this video helpful and captivating, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more mushroom growing tips and adventures. Also, visit MushroomSite.com where you can find everything related to mushrooms. We love sharing our passion for fungi with fellow enthusiasts and are excited to bring you even more content in the future. Speaking of which, be on the lookout for our upcoming videos. We'll explore other exciting mushroom varieties to grow at home, dive deeper into advanced cultivation techniques, and even take you on some wild foraging expeditions. Trust us, you will want to see what's coming up next. In the meantime, happy growing!